have another food video coming yeah. at you. Another day, another food video here from Lima, Peru. This time it's something exciting because we've never made a food video featuring a very famous dish here called pojo a la brasa, yep. which is basically rotisserie chicken. Mm -hmm. So we've gone by this restaurant. It's a chain called Pardo's and apparently they specialize in this dish. So we're going to head there. We've come to Larcomar, one of our favorite malls to come and hang out here yep. in Lima, <laughs> so with the beautiful views. Here. So many good restaurants here. We've located Pardo's and we're going to order that special dish along with some other things here today. Well, hell, the drinks have arrived. Hello, hello. So we're all settled in at the restaurant. We've ordered our chicken and we're waiting for that to arrive. But in the meantime, we got our drinks. We both got chicha morada, but two different versions. So I went with yeah. the classic, you know, your purple corn juice. Peruvian purple corn juice. Mm. So yeah. good. And then we saw that they had a frozen version, which looks a bit yeah. like a slushy. So we just had to so, try it. Yeah, so Sam got this one. <laughs> So, do you have a preference between the two? You know what? This one's more sour. It's more lemony. Okay. I feel like they've squeezed a lime or done something. But this one is sweeter. That's a classic then. But this one's more refreshing. Okay. So, <laughs> they're both really good is what I'm they're trying They're good to in say. Different, different ways. In different ways. Yeah, so these are the drinks. Alright Sam, first side dish, side order. Exciting orders, times. Yeah. The first side dish has come and this is called Rajitas de Camote. Yeah. And basically these are sweet potato crinkle chips. Yeah. And my goodness, they look good and they're fresh out of the oven or whatever they were cooking. Freshly fried. Freshly fried, <laughs> I should friend. say, not the oven. Fresh because out of the oil. they're warm, warm to the touch. So I've got some different sauces here. Yes. I think this might be the ahi one. Yeah, the yellow one is yeah. definitely ahi. Your aunt told me they had really good ahi sauce here. Yeah. So let's try that. It looks very creamy. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. They're really crispy on the outside, but then mushy and then as you bite into it. So much flavor, like, and they've, they've nice, been nicely, lightly salted too. Ooh. Oh my goodness, that's so good that I'm going in for a second. <laughs> a second one. So the food is here. Food has this arrived. This is what we came for. It is so much bigger than I thought it was going to be. Like we got the medium sized one. You, this is the, the half, half chicken. Half you can get chicken. a quarter as well. You can well. get a quarter. You can also get a full one. So yeah. this is the medium sized one and it is gigantic. It comes with, I think, some golden yellow potatoes as yes. well. And so yeah, I'm just gonna go in for the uh, pojo a la brasa. Ooh la la! Wow, that looks it, so juicy. And it's, it's roasted um, rotisserie, it's rotisserie chicken, yeah. And it's supposed to have a smoky flavor. Mm -hmm. I think this is honestly my first time to try it. I want to get some of the crispy skin on the outside. Oh wow, it's so juicy. You can tell already. I've had it before, oh. but always as delivery, so it's never quite fresh. Oh my gosh, that is so good. It's crispy on the outside, a little bit greasy. And then you bite into it and you've got like the soft tender chicken and a bit of a smoky flavor. You know what, I'm gonna try another bite. This time I'm gonna dip it into uh, the, in the, the sauce. sauce. Yeah. Wow. There we go. Dip it in there. Get in there. Oh, it's even better with the sauce. Yeah. Yeah, it gives it a spice. And now to try the golden potatoes. Yes. So you can tell they're really crispy on the outside here. You can see here, it looks like very fibrous potatoes. So I'm just gonna get myself a little bit small bite. Oh, that heat sauce is potent. It's like, it's like <laughs> it's burning, you now. It's burning on the back. Yeah, it's really hitting me on that bite. I'm gonna have some more of it though, because you can never get enough of heat sauce. Oh my gosh, I oh. <laughs> took it for a swim. <laughs> You're getting mm. more than you bargained for there. Mm -hmm. So in I go, this is the main dish we came for. So I'm gonna try some as well, yeah. even though I ordered a different chicken of my own. Yeah. So let's see what this is all about with potato, with potato. Mm. And with the crispy bit, I want the crispy bit. Get the crispy bit, don't forget that part. Mm. What do you think? Oh man. Isn't that good chicken? Mm -hmm. My goodness. Mm. For someone, for like a, a person to come here and eat that on their own, you'd have to be really hungry. Like it's such a big portion. Wow. I can't get over it. Honestly, I think the skin is my favorite yeah. part. Yeah. Like the skin just has a wonderful flavor. It's it coated does. in spices. I think that's what gives it the it's smoke crispy. the smoky flavor, crispy. It's a little greasy, it goes down nice. Yeah. Yeah. That's really this good. This is really good. And 
like we mentioned, this is a chain. You can yeah. find Cardo's chicken all over Lima. Yeah. And elsewhere in Peru, and I'm pretty sure they've expanded to yeah. neighboring countries. When I, when I was looking it up online, it, it, it formed, it started in the 1980s. So 1986. 1986. So my dish has also arrived, yeah. and I got the chicharrón de pollo. Um, I got a small portion just with four pieces. And basically it's chicken, yeah. kind of like covered in a batter and then deep fried. Right. And it comes with two pieces of white corn and yellow potato. Yeah, we've already had that yellow potato, so you can just try the corn for us. Let's take a moment to admire the, the size. The giant size. Of the grains or kernels, I'm not sure what you call these. Yeah. This is like the size of my nail. I know. Seriously, they're, they're so gigantic. Big. So you, big. You don't find corn quite... <laughs> Like anywhere outside They're of Peru. So like Peru is so, so unique. Peru. Peru is so uniquely large and good here. Alright, I'm gonna take my chicken yeah. and just dip it in the ahi sauce. Dip it. The sauce is Don't so get good. in there, it's so good. Mm. Mm. Is that nice? It's like creamy and yeah. spicy at yeah. the same time. And mm. th so th it's quite a quite, quite a different type of chicken than than the than the other mm. one. It's super lean. The chicken is super lean meat. Like this is probably chicken dry yeah. right here. How about so the good. corn? Corn is nice. Yeah, the corn's good too, huh? Yeah. Look at that thing. It's gigantic. Like, the corn makes an appearance in most dishes in yeah. Peru. So I've been eating a lot of corn since we arrived here. It's a staple for sure. Yeah. You get it a lot when you have anticuchos. Yeah. When you get the like cow yeah. hearts on a skewer, yeah. it always comes with corn. I think it goes great with meat because it's it's just kind of refreshing and juicy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So yeah, this is great. This is fantastic. Really huh? pleased so far. And we didn't even talk about your salad. No. So Sam's main came with a salad and we yeah. had two choices. We could choose the fresh salad, which yeah. I believe was tomato, lettuce, or and radishes. Right. Or we could choose the cooked salad, um, which is kind of like steamed vegetables. Right. So this one is carrots, green beans, and beetroot. Yeah, getting our veggies in with our meat so and, like, and carbs. <laughs> it's a, it's yeah. always a good thing. Mm. We've also got dessert on our minds too. The beetroot is so sweet. Is that nice? Wow. That's awesome. Mm. Okay, so I'm sharing my meal with Sam now. Yeah. Sharing is caring, so I'm going to try yours. Ooh, that's nice and stringy. The chicharro. Oh, the sauces are way over here. I was like looking for them. Yeah, <laughs> I stole them. This mm. kind of reminds me of popcorn chicken in North just, America. No, I was just thinking that. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, it does. Like giant popcorn chicken though. Yeah. Yeah. All right, and I'm going to try the, the chocolate, the, the giant corn here. It's going to take a huge bite into it. Mm. Mm. Check that out. Like just the size of those kernels is insane. So yeah. good. All right, let's try a bit of greens. Get a little bit of something healthy in. A well. little salad. I feel like we're really neglecting the potatoes in favor of the salad. It goes mm. to show how much potato we've been having these last few days. That's another thing that you have in almost every Peruvian meal. They somehow find a way to get potatoes in there too. Potatoes, rice, yeah. potatoes, and corn. Potatoes, rice, and corn make appearances very frequently. Yes. Mm. All right, we're going to take a moment and just enjoy now. Yep. Right, and because our mouths are bigger than our stomachs. Lemon pie. Oh, sorry, our eyes are bigger than our, our stomachs. Mouth. Our mouths. That too. <laughs> that too. We got some lemon pie. The size of the meringue on top of this pie it's impressive. is just a thing of beauty. Yeah. I know that's a that's a very Peruvian way of making the the, the, the lemon pies here because they're massive. I also remember when we had it at Manolo's, the, the meringue was huge too years ago. It's so like fluffy, like a cloud. Like a cloud. That is really good. And I would say it's more sweet than sour. Yeah. More sweet than tart. And yeah, oh. like the lemon part of the pie has kind of like a pudding-like consistency. Yeah. This is pretty good. Great way to finish things off, for sure. All right, it's that time price point. And before I even tell the price, like check out how many leftovers we're taking as takeaway for your grandma and aunt. Yeah, we barely, we could only eat half of what we ordered today. Yeah, that was a lot of chicken, a lot huge. of food. It's so many it's sides. Huge. So many sides. Yeah, like it ended up coming to 81 soles. So that included the two drinks, all of the mains and side dishes that you saw, plus a dessert at the end. 
and honestly, we could have definitely ordered less. We could have, so 20, basically 81 solis is 25 US dollars. Yeah. We could have ate for less than 10 US per person if we ordered less. So really good value. And another bonus tip, we came at 12. We were the first customers in here. Now it's just past one and check it out. It is absolutely packed. You I know, some people are having trouble seats. getting a table. People are having trouble. And we've also, it's not just here. We've noticed that in other popular restaurants in Peru too, that if you come at 12, you can usually almost always find a seat. You come at one and it's packed. So that's a tip for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Delicious chicken. And if you're in Lima, Peru, definitely try this out. We will see you on the next food video from Lima. Ciao for now. Bye.